And then we went to preliminary hearing and got into court with those brothers and sisters. But as well, we had observed a few days earlier, a uh, black panther was walking by the windows with what appeared to be an automatic weapon, which was the AR-16, which was semi-automatic. Semi-automatic is legal, right? Mm. <laughs> so what happened is this judge, this judge says to the DA, what the judge says to the DA, the guy says, why didn't you go out there on the outskirts in the woods with the Ku Klux Klan who were training with these weapons, the same AR-16? Just to be shit out of court. We won that. In other words, with the people's support, 200 some of different organizations all across the country came out to support us. That and the Senate investigation here is what stopped all the attacks and all the shootouts in this country. And it was about that whole united front against fascism, uniting people, etc. We lasted, they say we were in the United States, we lasted at least for, for five more years. Look, I could go on and on and on, and I think I'm going over time. Power to the people, thank you very much. the generalized criminalization of those communities that are most affected by poverty and racial discrimination. She draws upon her own experiences in the early 70s as a person who spent 18 months in jail and on trial after being placed on the FBI's 10 most wanted list for a crime she did not commit. She has also conducted extensive research on numerous issues related to race, gender, and imprisonment. Please welcome Angela Davis. Students don't last. Uh, 
Well, they shouldn't last that long. Right. Sometimes they exactly. last longer than they That's should. Exactly uh, uh, but I've been really impressed by the work that uh, has been done. And I took a look at some of the topics that you have um, been discussing today, the tuition heights, uh, um, public universities are no longer public. Mm. You know, whether in Canada or the US, uh, education has become um, uh, a commodity. Uh, and and if, we, if we think about uh, an era when, when education was something that people strove for because it had a connection to freedom, to liberation, education and liberation. Uh, but maybe we'll talk about uh, that later on. And I'm just going to look at some of the topics that, that the workshops explored. And organizing, how to fight the power and win. Of course, Barbie has been talking a lot about uh, uh, what community organizing is all about. Uh, and I should say that, um, I'll say this parenthetically, um, next year, is it 2016 is going to be the 50th anniversary, right, Bobby, of the founding of the Black Panther Party. And I don't know whether you've been following a lot of the um, a lot of the anniversary celebrations. Uh, we've had the 50th anniversary of the March on Washington, the 50th anniversary of Dr. King's letter from a Birmingham jail, the 50th anniversary of the Children's Crusade in Birmingham, Alabama, et cetera, et cetera. So I've been asking whether or not there will be any official recognition of the 50th anniversary of the founding of the Black Panther Party. 